Hey YouTube, it's me again, it's Jelana, and I'm coming to you with another video, and it is so sunny today. It's so bright, and the time of day, I guess, the sun is shining directly into my eyes, but hopefully this lighting will work out okay. You'll be able to see me, because I really wanted to feature today a outfit that I just received from Fabletics. And the reason why, I've just been kind of thinking about trying new things. And like I said in a previous video, I wanted to refresh my wardrobe. I also go to the gym quite a bit. And so I tend to wear the same gym clothes over and over and over again because, hey, they're going to get sweaty. They're going to, um, they're just, they're going to get sweaty. <laughs> so um, I don't spend a whole lot of money on gym clothes. But, you know, every once in a while, I'll see, you know, okay, it's time to get a, a new pair of pants or absolutely have to change out my sneakers from time to time as those wear out. And it's really important to um, to buy new sneakers because of the support that you need when you're exercising. So there's all of that. But, you know, I started looking at my gym clothes and thinking it's time to get a couple of new pieces. Sports bras are really difficult for me because... Um, I wear a 34 triple D when I can find it. And then most of the time I can find a 36 double D. So if I have a perfect fit, I like the 34 triple D or I think it's an E or an F. <laughs> so the girls need support. I'm doing boot camp. I'm doing a lot of jumping, jumping jacks, jumping over things. And so I need to have that support. So those... For me, everything else is just icing on the cake. I just need to make sure that I have the right sports bra on. Well, I've been getting emails from Fabletics uh, for a uh, outfit for $17.95, which includes a top, a sports bra, and a pair of pants. And so they have a couple of different options on their site. And so I started thinking, well, let me try them out. Um, I think $17.95 is a pretty good deal. And for three pieces, if I can get even the sports bra from the site to work for me, I am ahead of the game because it's def it was definitely time for me to purchase another sports bra. The sports bras I generally purchase are the shock absorber sports bras. And um, they're pretty good. I, I really have liked those. I think they've changed the sizing because recently the sizing has been a little bit off for me. But... Anyhow, I thought, let me try out Fabletics. I mentioned it to someone and they said, oh yeah, they have really good sports bras. But when I looked at her, I don't think that she had the 34 Triple D girls. Um, and so I still wanted to give them a try because of the price. I thought it would be worth a while. Now, Fabletics is under the same family of uh, online stores as Just Fab, which is a shoe line. And I also have purchased shoes from them, and I've been happy with the shoes that I've purchased from them in the past, and so I thought, okay, I'll do it. So really, it's a subscription service that they want you to purchase something from them every month. I don't do it with just fab. I do it in an as-needed basis, and uh, when they're having a really good sale, I may pick up a pair of shoes or two. It would probably be the same thing with Fabletics if I was happy with the outfit. So here's the outfit. It is a sports bra. And it's a little t-shirt and then also some black capri pants. Um, my first impression of the entire outfit, and I'll definitely stand up so you can see, get a full um, picture of everything, is that the quality is really good. Um, the fabrication on everything is very good. And actually, at the end of the video, I'll take it off and I will... Um, I'll tell you what the fabrication is on everything and the original prices of everything because for some reason there was no invoice at all in the box. But basically, it's a more, I think it's in, um, it's in a comparable brand or they want to be comparable to like Lululemon and I heard that that's pretty, they're pretty pricey. And this is also to me pretty pricey. Now, I've been through Forever 21. I see that they now have sportswear. I've been through... Um, Old Navy also now has uh, sportswear, gym, gym wear in their um, stores as well. So, and then there's always Target. But Target to me, their clothing was also kind of pricey uh, in terms of gym wear too. Because I'm super, super cheap about gym. I'm not going there to um, 
to meet anybody. I'm going there to sweat. And so I don't, I want to look, you know, like I've at least matched and pulled together somewhat, but it's not really a big deal to me whether or not it's fashionable or whatever the case may be. So in terms of a review on the sports bra, it fits very nicely. Um, I'm not sure it has the support that I really want. It kind of comes up around the neck. And um, again, I'll show you that when I stand up. Um, the t-shirt is super cute. It's a good throw over everything sort of a t-shirt. And the, and the uh, capri pants fit really well. So I think my, my first re over imp overall impression and my first gut instinct is that I won't continue a subscription with them because the sports bra is not that fabulous. It's good enough. It'll be okay when I'm doing things like um, Fierce Funk where I'm dancing and there's not a whole lot of bounce. Well, there's some bounce, but not as much as boot camp. When it comes to boot camp, I will have to go back to my shock absorber. And I will also... When I'm, uh, when I'm telling you the prices and I show you some of the details of this um, outfit, I will also bring out my, one of my shock absorber bras so you can see the difference between the two. So with uh, no further ado, I'm going to go ahead and stand up and let you see um, the outfit from head to toe. And then I will uh, show you the pricing and the fabrication and the construction and then also compare it to the shock absorber. Okay, so this is the outfit. It's just kind of like a little muscle tee that comes over. It's got a cute little permanent knot in the corner. And then these are the capri pants. They, um, they're they really nice, um, soft uh, fabrication. I really like them. And then I'll take this off so you can see the, um, the sports bra as well. But just wanted you to get an idea of what the outfit looked like in terms of the top and the pants. So this is the sports bra. It um, it fits pretty good. It's kind of, it's got that razor back in the back, and then it also has a clasp in the back that um, that you can adjust. I have it on the tightest um, the tightest notch, so it fits tightest. This is a size large. Um, again, I don't think that. In terms of when I'm doing more high impact uh, exercises that this is really going to um, um, gonna provide me with the support I need but I would always I'd never wear it like this to the gym I would always wear it just like I wear my other bras up under something else um, but I do think that for what it is it's it's a really nice uh, sports bra Okay, so I jumped out of that outfit and um, I just put on, threw on another t-shirt just so I can again show you uh, or talk to you a little bit about the fabrication. Now, in terms of pricing for that whole outfit going forward, if it wasn't under the special, I believe this subscription is $49.95 a month. So you would get one outfit for $49.95 a month and there's a bunch of different outfits that you can pick from. So you're looking at $50 plus dollars a month for workout gear if you wanted to add one new outfit into your wardrobe um, every month. Now, it might be worth it. Again, I would have to do some comparison shopping, really start to look at what H&M, not H&M, yeah, what uh, Forever 21 has, what Old Navy has, and um, do I like to do the comparison shopping. I always want to feel like I'm getting the best value for my dollars. So I would definitely do that. It might be worth it for me just to do it for a few months, just to get a few new pieces before summer hits. Um, that I have um, that I can wear to the gym. So we'll see. So these pants, these are the Capri pants I spoke about I, that I had on and they are made from, it doesn't, oh, well, I guess I better look at this, uh, this tag. They're made 80% polyester and, sorry, 88% polyester. And that's all that they say. So it must be 88% oh, 12% uh, elastane. And they are, again, they're very comfortable. I have no complaints about these pants. As you probably saw when I, when I showed them to you as I was standing up, they come up high enough. They feel like they won't slip and slide down. I won't have to tug and pull at them. These are a size medium. Um, I'm 5'3". And... Um, 
they seem to fit me just fine. I usually wear a size eight in bottoms, so the mediums fit fine. And then this tee is made of a soft jersey fabric and um, with a twisted knot detail. And it's super, super soft. It's, I like, I like the t-shirt. I think I could get away with wearing the t-shirt um, just out without even having to wear it to the gym. But it was an, it's a nice t-shirt for what it's, you know, for what it is. It's, it's cute. I like the little knotting detail. I think that's kind of a cute addition. Now, in terms of the, the piece that resistance, the sports bra, this is what I was speaking of. There's a clasp and it does fasten like a bra does. This is a contraption to get on. I will say that much. It is a contraption. I'm going to move over a little bit into the light. It is a contraption to get on. It, um, you know, you have to pull it over your head and then you have to fight with trying to get that back um, clasped together. So if you have somebody to help you, that's going to be a bonus. One of the things I really like about this is that it does have that razor back, which my existing sports bras do not have because you'll see they are serious, like bulletproof sports bras. Again, I was going to jump up and down for you so you could see, but I just thought that that might be a little too weird. But it, it does have some bounce. The girls do move around a little bit in it. I don't feel completely secure enough to do burpees and, and things like that in this. I just don't think that this is going to foot the bill for walks, for hikes, things like that. This is going to be fine, but when it comes to really high impact um, sort of exercising, I'm going to have to go back to Old Faithful. And this is my shock absorber um, bra. And I don't know, I'll leave them, probably try to leave the information about the style of it below. This is a 34 uh, F US and there's European sizing and everything as well that goes with this. It's a European 75 F. Huh. Wow. So that sounds high, right? And this clasps again, just like a, a bra does. And it also, um, it's shaped like a bra. It comes up, you know, to secure you all the way around. And the straps, they're a little, have a little bit of give to them, but you can adjust the strap all the way so that it doesn't really have any give. So you have no bouncing or very minimal bouncing. So this is a burpee bra um, that you would, that you'd want. Some of the older, um, I have an older one that I didn't want to show on camera because it's pretty. It looks like it's an older one. But the straps had no elastic in them. And I think that they changed it just so that they would be a, it would be a little bit more of a comfortable bra. But to be quite honest with you, I would I feel more comfortable feeling like everything is tight and and held in and not moving around than I do than I care as much about whether or not. Um, the straps have a little bit of give to them. So I really kind of wish they would go back to the straps that have no zero zip elastic in them. So anyhow, I hope this was helpful. If you have sm a smaller um, breast, then you probably will be fine with Fabletics. And if you uh, like a higher quality or a perceived higher quality um, sort of athletic wear, then I think you really, really enjoy them if you, and you like stuff coming to your door. For me, I don't mind going out and shopping. I don't mind going out and trying things on. I think I will do that a little bit more before I make a commitment. And uh, I may actually just go ahead. You have to cancel it because you've given them your information. So I may just go in and cancel and I can always start back or um, because it's on the same schedule as Just Fab, which every month you go in and you just say, I don't want anything. And then you don't get charged. I may just do that and and not even bother to cancel just because I just maybe want to keep an eye on their website and see what comes up. But again, I really do like the sports bra. I think it's nice. Again, it'll be nice for walks. It will be nice for um, any lower impact sort of exercising. But when I go back to doing anything higher impact, the girls, 34 triple D, F, 
E, whatever it, whatever I am, they need um, a little bit more support. But anyhow, the whole outfit's cute, very high, very good quality, um, very good craftsmanship. Um, so the finishing on it is really nice. So if you're interested, take a look. I'll leave a link below. And until next time, stay tuned, stay positive. Be sure and like this video if you want to see more sorts of reviews of different product lines. And also, um, be sure and subscribe if you want to see more of my videos or and you want to you know just be in tune with when I upload videos. Be sure and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, stay tuned and stay positive. Bye!